Well, we got a new uh, jump starter power bank uh, product, NextPow, to test out. And um, it looks uh, like the uh, unit is pretty impressive looking. Um, here we got the, uh, I think it's got 2,000 milliamp hour battery in there. Um, I've got it connected already to uh, my test load for uh, measuring a load on the uh, the battery pack over here. But uh, this is the first starter pack that I've ever seen turn on voltage temporarily, um, probably to test to see if the battery is uh, in good health. Um, but it you you can see it's outputting a voltage past 16 volts or around 16 volts um, also I'm measuring the um, the scope measurement of what what the uh, battery pack is doing it's got uh, this funky uh, square waveform pattern it's it's putting out and like I said it's probably trying to see if there's a battery uh, connected to it but um, I'm not really sure if I like uh, how it's trying to uh, determine those kind of things but um, interesting enough when I um, turn on the uh, the load on the jumper pack it really does something strange so um, let's uh, turn on the switch here and see what happens so it doesn't like a load on the battery pack and it starts beeping and then it turns on 12 volts for a short period of time and then goes back to the testing mode. So, out of all the uh, packs that I've tested so far, um, this is the uh, strangest operation, and I'm not really sure if uh, if it's worthwhile um, trying to uh, start up your uh, vehicles and stuff. But anyway, I'm not going to do any more testing on this unit. Um, it's, it's kind of funky. It does have uh, um, some USB ports on it. And I think on the side there was a, uh, a USB-C interface plus you, you have a barrel jack. So um, that was kind of nice. I like the, uh, the case here as well. But with this funky behavior, um, this is not going to make the cut for me. Hope uh, you found this video uh, informative.